guys, so I have another holiday video for you all. That is why I am wearing my Santa hat and my red lipstick. And I just noticed my Santa hat is not doing my hair justice because I got my hair trimmed a couple days ago for the upcoming holidays. And now when I wear my Santa hat, my hair just kind of like is pressed against my face and it doesn't look too hot, but that did not stop me from wearing my Santa hat. So I have a holiday gift guide video and I know I am super late on this and I apologize, but I feel like this will be helpful for the last minute shoppers like me because you still have a couple days to do your Christmas shopping and you can definitely find great thoughtful gifts for any price range and for anybody. And if you already did your Christmas shopping, maybe the things I mentioned in this video you will put on your Christmas list. I know in gift guide videos, a lot of gurus have the items that they are mentioned so they're able to show you guys but for me I don't have too many of the things that I'm gonna be mentioning because I'm either use them as gifts for family or for friends or they're on my Christmas list so I don't have them in reach but regardless all of the things that I'm gonna be mentioning I think will work great as gifts for anybody for family for friends for loved ones and I know that they will love them so let me begin because I know this video is gonna be super long just like all of my videos the first idea I have is gift cards and I know you're thinking gift cards like those are so not personable I'm not gonna hand a family member or a friend an envelope with a gift card in it but I have some ways to make a gift card a little bit more thoughtful just by adding a couple extra things to go along with the theme of the gift card so first if you have somebody, whether it's a friend, a mom, a dad, any other family member who is a coffee lover, definitely get them either a Starbucks or Dunkin Donuts gift card. I know I would love that because I get coffee every morning before I go to school. To go along with that coffee gift card, buy them either a coffee cup or a travel coffee mug. And you can find inexpensive coffee cups of all different designs, patterns, and colors at stores like Target, Walmart, TJ Maxx, and Marshall. Also throw in some cookies to go along with the coffee and the coffee mug. You can either buy the cookies from a store or make them at home. So I think those extra things really emphasize that coffee theme and make it a little bit more personable. Next is a gift card to any clothing store, which is my favorite kind of gift card because I love shopping. But it is hard to buy clothes for others because you might not know their size or their style. So gift cards always work the best and this is perfect for anybody, whether it's a sister, a mom, a best friend. Choose a gift card to a store that you know they like and will use. And then to go along with the gift card, buy a pair of inexpensive earrings or bracelet or necklace or even a scarf and you can find inexpensive accessories at Forever 21 and that way when they have their gift card they can go to the store and pick out an outfit to match that accessory for a completed look. Next gift card idea is for the book lovers and those who like to read so get them a gift card to a bookstore but then to add something to the gift card maybe you would like to throw in a bookmark that way when they are reading their new book they have something to hold their place. Next idea is for those who like to get their nails done but hate to spend the money. So get them a manicure gift certificate. Don't forget to throw in a nail polish. That way they can use that color when they get their nails done. I think that is such a great idea. Those are some of my gift card ideas. There are so many gift cards out there that can be used by anybody that will fit their personality. So those are kind of some of my ways to make gift cards more thoughtful and personable. I love giving gifts that have like a theme to it. So these next couple gift ideas all have some sort of theme. So the first one is winter and winter is very cold obviously and you need some things to keep warm but you want to look stylish at the same time and this will work great for anybody so maybe you want to pick out a scarf a pair of gloves and then some sort of an accessory to go along with it so you can find scarves anywhere scarves of all different prices all different sizes colors shapes patterns pretty much wherever but my favorite places to buy scarves are Forever 21, TJ Maxx, and Marshalls and I have two of my favorite scarves that I recently purchased so you can definitely find these and the first one I got at Old Navy and I love the color and this is super warm it's like a travel print pattern but then the colors are so bright something you wouldn't expect for the winter time you have some like pinks, blues, greens, and yellows and I really like the look and then at the bottom it has some fringe so this will keep you warm and will look great and you can definitely find gloves 
or like earrings or bracelets to match this. And then the other scarf I found at Target. It's a gray scarf with these stars on it. I really like the look of it and it's very versatile. And then you can find gloves at any store, but some really cool gloves that I think will be great as gifts are those gloves that can work with any smartphone so you don't have to worry about taking your gloves off to use your phone. And I've seen those gloves sold at like Lord & Taylor's, Macy's, and they are a little bit more pricey than just like regular glove but I know that they are super useful so that is my winter theme gift idea next gift idea has a lazy cozy winter night theme because after the holidays everybody is looking for a nice relaxing night so I have a couple things that are essentials first thing is some nice fuzzy warm cozy pajamas you can get like a pajama set that has a shirt and some pants or you can just buy some flannel warm pajama bottom one of my favorite types of of warm pajama pants are these and I got these at Walmart and they were only like five dollars and these are just like pink with some polka dots they are so warm they keep me nice and toasty at night and you can get a box of hot chocolate you can go to the grocery store and just get your normal hot chocolate brand or you can go to a special store and get like a nice special brand of hot chocolate doesn't matter hot chocolate is hot chocolate no matter what kind it is so I think that is a cute idea also throw in some sort of food maybe like a box of cookies or box of candy, chocolate, popcorn. It's just something that they have to drink and munch on when they are lounging around in their comfy pajamas. And then you can't forget something to do. Maybe you can throw in a book or a magazine or even like a DVD just to keep their mind off of the craziness just so they can relax because sometimes on a Friday or Saturday night I'd rather just be in my room relaxing than going out and of course you can never go wrong with body lotion soaps fragrance mist you can definitely find those kind of things at Bath and Body Works that store sells so many scents and products some of them you can find like already pre-wrapped and pre-packaged and they are reasonably priced and they make great gifts for anybody. I love doing that for my friends because I think that is so cute and it's really useful. And then you can also check out like a Lush. They sell like the same kind of things, any type of store like that. You can also even check out like a Marshalls or TJ Maxx. I know that they sell a lot of like hand soaps and cream. You can never go wrong with that kind of gift. And then of course you can never go wrong with makeup and that's like my favorite type of gift in the whole entire world. So I have a couple products that I think will work great as gifts for those makeup lovers. First few items are from the drugstore and because drugstore makeup is reasonably priced, you can definitely pick out a couple items for a whole completed look. You can put them in a nice bag, a box, or even like a Christmas stocking. You can definitely have fun with like the packaging. So the first item that I think works great for a gift is the Maybelline Color Tattoo Cream Eyeshadows. They come in a huge variety of colors so you can definitely find a color that someone would like and these stay on forever they work great as eyeshadows or eyeshadow bases and they are only like seven dollars then I love eyeshadows so you can get them like a cream eyeshadow and then you can get them like an eyeshadow palette to wear on top of their cream eyeshadow and some of my favorite palettes are these wet and wild color icon palettes and this is in the color petal pusher these are such pretty purple shades and these are only four dollars and you get eight eyeshadows so I think this will be really helpful you have like a whole completed look these Maybelline eye studio quads this is the color copper chic this is great for those who likes neutral eyeshadows great for like school and for the daytime and these are super pigmented and I love elf products you can find this at Target or even Urban Outfitters and this is the 32 neutral eyeshadow palette and this is so helpful for those who are just beginning with makeup or those who just like neutral eyeshadows you get all of these pretty eyeshadows, all different formulas. You have a lot of like shimmery shades. You even have some matte shades. This will definitely be a great addition to anybody's collection. And then if you want to spend a little bit more money on makeup for someone, definitely check out your Sephora. Because a lot of the brands come out with like value sets and you can find a value set for anybody. For those who just like eyeshadows or maybe lip glosses or blushes or perfume. My favorite brands that have the best value sets that are good values are Stila. I know that they have an eyeshadow palette. This was their last year's holiday eyeshadow palette and you get 
all of these eyeshadows, all different colors, and I believe this came with an eyeliner, and this was such a great price. They have a similar edition this year. And then if you have someone who loves lip products, I know that Stila has like their lip glaze set, and you get a lot of these like lip glazes that are great. They are great lip glosses. They aren't sticky, and they stay on forever. And then also check out like Tarte. I know that they have like a blush and lip set that is really popular this year. Um, Smashbox, Too Faced, even the Sephora brand. And then two of my favorite palettes that I think everybody has to have are the Urban Decay Naked Palettes. I have the original one right here and then I have the Naked 2 palette. I think these work great as gifts. They are $50 each. But you get so much. I can't live without my palettes and I don't want to talk too much about the differences in palettes in this video because I actually have a whole separate video talking about the original Naked palette compared to the Naked 2 palette. So I will link that somewhere over here. Definitely check out that video if you're interested in either buying yourself a Naked palette or if you're buying someone else a Naked palette and you don't know which one to buy or just buy both. So those are all of my makeup gift ideas. Oh, I am so out of breath right now. These gift guide videos seem to get so long, so tiring because I just have so much to say. But I think that is it for this last minute holiday gift guide shopping video hopefully you did find all of my ideas very helpful and this will help relieve some of the stress of your holiday shopping if you have any other holiday video requests please 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 let me know I want to film more and more but I know that the holiday season is coming to a close which makes me very upset so if you do have a video that you really really want to see let me know thank you guys so so much for watching and I will see you next video bye